I do. Hi, everybody. Uh, this lesson is uh, angles and inscribed uh, quadrilaterals inside a circle. Sorry, I'm coming down with the cold, so my voice is cracking. This is an uh, integrated math 2 lesson. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. What can we conclude about the angles of a quadrilateral that's inscribed in a circle? Okay, so here's our theorem, you guys, an inscribed uh, quad theorem. If a quadrilateral in a, is inscribed in a circle, then the opposite angles are supplementary. So here's a picture right here. So that it means that this angle plus this angle is 180, and this angle plus this angle is 180, okay? So let's go ahead and uh, do a couple of problems here. Find the angle measures of each inscribed quadrilateral. Okay, so so if the quadrilateral, here we have one, two, and it only works for quadrilaterals, three, four, four sides. Uh, if it's inscribed in this uh, circle right here, then it turns out that this angle plus this angle equals 180, and this angle plus this angle equals 180. So let's go ahead and um, uh, do the P and R equals 180. All right, so when we do that, we uh, combine like terms and subtract and then divide, and we get y equals 8. Okay, so this says find the angle measure. So we can find the angle measures by plugging in y equals 8 here and or here and here. Okay, now once we find this one, we know this one because it's uh, the supplement because they add up to 180. And once we plug in 8 right here, 8 squared plus uh, 53, we find the supplement, and that will give us uh, S because the uh, opposite angles are supplementary. Okay, so so angle P, when we plug in 8 right there, is, 50, is 43 degrees. Okay, let's go ahead and plug in 8 right here. So we get 117, and so the other angles are their supplements right there. Okay, so 43 uh, and 137 gives us uh, 180 right here, and then this one was uh, uh, 117, so 117 plus 63 also gives us 180 right there. Okay, let's try one more. All right, so find the angle measures here. Okay, so um, here we have uh, 1, 2, 3, 4. Again, it only happens when a quadrilateral is inscribed in a circle, and if it is, then this angle plus this angle is 180, and this angle plus this angle is 180, okay? So here we go. We're going to say these two angles, because they're the ones that give us both x's right there, adds up to 180. So combining like terms, subtracting, dividing, we get x equals 12, okay? So when we plug x equals 12 up here, and I'm going to plug it in right here, and then that'll, and we'll do the supplement to get this one, and plug in x equal 12 right here, and then we do the supplement to get this one right here, okay? Now, so I noticed um, uh, this book uh, makes lots of mistakes, and I copied this picture from my book right here, and it says this angle right here is 123 degrees. Well, I think they got them mixed up. I think this one goes down here, and this one should have been the 39 uh, plus 7x, and this one up here should have been the 6x minus 15. I mean, doesn't this look like an acute angle right here, and, not, and doesn't this look like an obtuse angle right here? But, you know, given given the diagram and how it is right here, it says this angle is 123 degrees. Now, this angle looks like it's 80 right here, so this angle over here is 100 right there, no problem. But um, uh, this angle is definitely a lot, not 57, and this angle up here is definitely not 123. I think the book, the textbook, got these two angles mixed up. Anyways, you, you guys get the idea right there. That my the textbook is making lots of mistakes. Anyways, uh, if you're in our class, that's going to be your assignment. I hope that makes sense. Take care.